Hello everyone, my name is Gao Tong, and that's my co-speaker Song Bang Chengjin. And it's our, our honor to standing here to introduce a, I'm sorry, to introduce a security vulnerability detection framework to you. And its name is Jemai. And it, it is developed in the open coding community for all Linux operating system. And next, I will show you Jemai from four aspects. The brief introduction, the technical details, the development plan of Jemai, and the open source of achievement of Jemai. At first, I will show you the background of Jemai. It was born in the OpenKaling community. OpenKaling is an open source desktop operating system root community. It has an open and independent code construction platform and tries to enforce the innovation driven growth. And it as a ecological source, it tries to promote the sustainable development of Linux software and hardware. And we aim to become an active open source community with international influence. And the founder of Jemai is the Open Keyling Security Governance SIG Group, which we aim to provide, uh, pro, uh, we aim to product the most secure products and secure, uh, security community products to you. I, against this background, Jemai has taken root in the Open Keyling community. And the Chinese phrase Jemai is a Chinese medicine term. It means a doctor uses his fingers to feel a patient's artery and find the internal changes in the body of the patients. And we use Jemai to name the security detection tool. And we hope Jemai can see the small clues of the vulnerabilities in the Linux operating system. Uh, Jemai was originally designed to respond to the community vulnerabilities and propose solutions. Uh, the, the, the community e security issues mainly include vulnerability data management, community vulnerability repair, community SDL process development, and discovering and referring of vulnerabilities and research on community security attack. At last, we hope to provide a security detection tools to the users of the Linux operating systems. Before the birth of Jemai, uh, the security detection tools mainly solve two problems. The first is how to confirm the existence of a vulnerability, and the second is how to determine the effectiveness of the repair. Well, so these two problems, there are many difficulties. The, fir the, the first difficulty is that the main security tools mainly both uh, mostly rely on version matching and they don't uh, uh, ver ver validate the uh, vulnerabilities from uh, the attack and the defense perspective. The second problem is that it's, it's a high investment work to collect uh, proofs of concept POC because uh, valuable POC might cost much worth millions of dollars. And POC has compatibility problems in different, diff different situations, like different architectures, different systems, or different computers. And POC may even cause damage to the computer. While solving these four difficulties, we provide four targeted solutions. Uh, the first solution is that uh, we use POC validate as the main method uh, of the detection, and we establish a community reward plan to invite a security experts from various industries to join in the participation of the code. And the OpenKaling Security Governance SSG Group 
modify, test, and digest the POCs to ensure the compatibility of the POCs. And we also use a sandbox mode to, to avoid the damage to the computer. And we make sure that Gemini can keep running on the computer. The open Kelly security governance SIG responds to and identifies security issues in the community and proposes solutions. We maintain the development of these security de detection tools. Uh, GMI was established in 2022 February, and until now, it has submitted 20. 2,000 of lines of code, and we have uh, 27 original public vulnerabilities and 68 original private vulnerabilities. Over 40% of the vulner vulnerabilities are high risk, and more than 300 people joined in the contribution of this project. Uh, we have published 33 pieces of papers about the security attract and defense uh, field. The next part is the de de technology details of Gemini, include the technology architecture, characteristics, technical advantages, utility assessment. Uh, we chose Golang language as the development foundation of Gemini for several reasons. Uh, Golang language has excellent concurrent programming advantages and high pro, uh, pro, uh, practical efficiencies. And the time required for completion is very short. And Golang also has abandoned ecosystem and built-in libraries. Uh, in terms of detection efficiency, uh, it usually takes uh, 12 hours or even longer. I'm sorry? Oh, hello? Wait, wait, okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, the it on, often takes twelve hours or even longer to uh, detect a POC by manually way, manual way, and Gemini only takes about twenty five seconds to run over uh, seventy uh, POCs, and the time is short. And the occurrence of Gemini reached over 90% is also higher than the manual way. According to the vulnerabilities detected by Gemini, the open cleaning system has repaired over 70 vulnerabilities, and it shortens the repair cycle of vulnerabilities, and the security of the operating system is improved. The Technical architecture of Gemini consists of four parts. The core part is the framework layer. It modularized each function, like use case execution, baseline track, report, concurrently management, POC. Data. Hello. Data service. Remote management, sandbox, and cache. The network layer consists managing. Hello. Yes. The network layer manages the remote transmission and remote monitoring. Monitoring. The data layer verifies the data into POC data, vulnerability data, and the security information data. The application layer interacts with the users. Uh, straightly, uh, people can choose local test, remote testing, and report analysis. And knowledge management, people can uh, track the security knowledge in the knowledge uh, uh, repositories. And the detection of Gemini consists of four main parts. Uh, the core part is the vulnerability 
vulnerability detection. It consists system, vulner system vulnerability detection and wipe vulnerability detection. System vulnerability consists the public CVE detection and the original uh, GMI uh, vulnerability uh, detection. The Y vulnerability consists of the weak passwords, unauthorized access, and so on. The fusing model consists the fusing test for kernel and for uh, security interfaces. The baseline security detection consists intrusion detection and security configuration detection. Intrusion detection detects the processes, files, and logs of the system. And security configuration detection consists the detection of operating system configuration, network system configuration, and the application system configuration. The evaluation part consists uh, the local evaluation and remote evaluation. Uh, GMI can use SSH and SAP to achieve the remote connection. The patch model consists the patch information for system vulnerabilities and the repair suggestions for why vulnerabilities and other security infos about uh, security uh, about the vulnerability repairs. And this flow chart will show the detection details of Gemini. Uh, first, Gemini will obtain all of the security info and data from the data layer and the, the JSON parser and YAML parser will formulate the data into the formulated way. And Gemini will store all of this formulated data into the cache. If people choose local assessment and uh, Gemini will detect the system uh, concurrently, it will call the co-routing co pool and request pool for the uh, vulnerability detection. And uh, if people choose remote assessment, it will use SSH or SSP to connect. And then Gemma will call the validator author rhythms to validate the detected result. And then Gemma will uh, detect the whole systems and form a detect report to the users. All of these process are running in the sandbox. Uh, the characteristics of Gemini can consist of three parts. Uh, first, Gemini use uh, POC detection as the core detection method and version matching as the auxiliary uh, detection method. And Gemini use sandbox mode to solve the impact of POC on the computer. Uh, also, Gemini uh, uh, includes some cut cutting edge technologies. It introduced an AI module for auto generation of security baseline items. And it used fusing to test the interface of the operating system. And as an uh, open source tech detection tools, the advantages of Gemini is very evident. Uh, it has very good social participation. We have invited people, uh, security experts from universities, security vendors, online security guards, and community enthusiasts to join in the contribution of Gemini. And the attract defense think tank of Gemini also provide uh, also provide security guarantees for the development of Gemini. Uh, once a uh, POC has, uh, uh, once a uh, Gemini submitted a POC, the Open Kelly Security Governance SSG Group will conduct a, a review and to the POC and ensure that it, it's uh, ensure its compatibility and formulate it, and then we will. 
uh, give uh, follow, uh, we will comply the open healing vulnerability disclosure policy to expose the POC. And then by the original POCs, uh, we, we will draw some security experts to join in the contribution of the code. Uh, Jemai tr aims to uh, provide accuracy, practicality, expensiveness, and we try to give users uh, the repair functions and concise UI. Open Healing Security Governance SIG Group uh, uh, makes sure uh, uh, supplies and maintains the development of Jemai and tries to make it better. Uh, open uh, Gemini improved the security of Linux operating systems from five aspects. First, uh, it used auto scanning to improve the efficiency of detection, and uh, a comprehensive scanning and testing will reduce the minute detection errors and improve the accuracy of detection, and discover and fix vulnerabilities before they cause consequence. Uh, it will uh, improve the cost benefit, and we use baseline detection to find data breaches or privacy leakages, uh, and so that you can take mirrors to protect your privacy. Uh, we also, uh, it is also able to identify configuration issues of the systems to improve the security of the Linux operating system. The next part is the development of development plan of Gemini. We have finished the, the patch info import function, fielding detection function, and open AI interface to add more comprehensive AI repair suggestions in 2023. And we plan to add insurance detection model to improve the ability of resisting network attacks in 20, in, at the beginning of 2024. And we plan to draw a perfect the black box fielding model to put uh, for the potential security threats. And we also plan to perfect the white box fielding model to inspect the logical structure of systems in 2025. Uh, Open Kaling has achieved a little results. Uh, until now, the POC repository of Shemai has cons uh, contains uh, over 200 uh, of POCs, and many of them has invited, uh, uh, many of them was included by mainstream vulnerability in intelligence platforms in China and the world, such as CV and Chinese CNAD. And Gmai also got the second prize of the 2022 Chinese Open Source Innovation Competition and also joined the Open Item Global Open Source Summit as an uh, exhibit in 2023. The social partic participation of Gmai also increasing uh, over 10 security vendors, three universities, and, uh, and security experts in uh, various industries has joined in the part in the contribution of Gemai and Open Kaling uh, Security Governance SIG also got the most popular award of the Open Kaling uh, as a new attempt for open source the oper desktop operating system. Open Kaling has uh, won a little result also. Uh, Open Kaling has participated in the open source work of China, Japan, and South Korea as a group, group leader of Chinese enterprises. And we also become Visa Chairman and Under Secretary General of Chinese OSS Promote Union and became a platinum member of the Open Atom Foundation. Open Kelly has contributed millions of lines of the code in OpenStax, Linux kernel, and so on. And we hope in the future we hope to invite uh, international friends to join in the particip participation of Jemai or 
uh, communicate with us in the open Kling community and improve the security of Linux operating system in the future. That's all of my speech. Thank you of you. Thanks of for your listening. This is the project code line and link and uh, 3w.openkling.com is the host page of OpenKling. I actually have a question about the proof of concept. So you said so it, it seems like at the core of your detection is actually trying to detect a vulnerability per proof of concept. Yeah. So what is it proof of concept program typically is? Is it just like you know, let's say we have vulnerability, some classical buffer overflow. And and, and and is it just, you know, a program which is gonna trigger that buffer overflow in that code and let's say you're detecting that, you know, a certain you have Kazan enabled or some other and you're detecting detecting certain event, or w can you tell more about what is this proof of concept? Uh, the proof, uh, the promote detection is about the promote services. Okay, it's the detection to promote services uh, or computers. Like if you don't have a computer nearby, maybe you need a remote a promote detection for the promote uh, for the computer. But I, I'm just trying to understand what is this proof of concept by itself, like the code which you try to run to detect vulnerability. So could you give an example of what it would typically be? I guess you're not asking people to contribute real-world exploits. Yes. Or, so, so is it just something simpler or...? Uh, well, this project is still development. It is still in uh, development, so uh, we are glad to invite people to join in this project. Uh, you can uh, you can submit POC or detection method to this project, and uh, or join in the development like our development plan. Yeah. So, so for the POCs which so far have been submitted, so what are they typically look like? Uh, it will have a comprehensive, uh, comprehensive uh, the detection in the future. No, no, but but now you said that you have a number of POCs which are already there. So, so what do we do? Uh, if you have a new POC, like uh, uh, or it have a original new POC, and you can join in this job, or you can perfect our the uh, POCs, like uh, we have already uh, uh, original POCs, and you can exchange it. And the original POC is also in that repository, so you can just take a look, right? Yes. Okay, yeah, so probably it's easy to take a look, thank you. Any other questions? Now let's thank the speaker.